guys, it's Kara. Um, I have another issue that I wanted to come here and talk to you guys about because I know if I say something about it, maybe somebody will have some advice for me. Um, I was having another issue during a test. Um, I get like hand cramps and pain and uh, exhaustion, obviously, and I just, I couldn't write the answers. I couldn't finish my test. I was able to eventually, but I had to sit and just kind of like massage my hands and Close my eyes a little bit. <laughs> it was a Spanish test again, of course. Um, I'm gonna make a future video about learning a foreign language with uh, chronic fatigue. Um, but now it's about the, the hand cramp, pain, exhaustion thing. Anyway, it doesn't happen to me all that often unless I'm having to write a lot. And a lot isn't really a lot for me because I don't do that much handwriting. Um, and I don't know, it's not even that common anymore to like handwrite more than a paragraph probably. But I wasn't even writing a paragraph. I was writing like single fill in the blank answers and I just couldn't write anymore. And you know, if if you have chronic fatigue syndrome that is, you know that once one part of your body is tired, like if you went up a set of stairs, your legs are tired, just your whole body is depleted. It's ridiculous. I <laughs> writing one one word answers onto a test and my hand gets too tired I have to close my eyes that I don't know but I just wanted to see if anyone on here has any advice for me because I don't know how to uh, prevent that from happening before it happens or what to do while it's happening or if there's any way to improve it after it has happened or anything like that so I'm begging you guys give me something to work with hopefully someone will comment you can send me a message um, I don't have an email for this channel, but maybe I'll set that up at some point. Um, that's it. I'll see you next video, and thank you so much for any of the advice you might give.